What's going on everyone? This is Eric from X Interact here and today we're going to be going over some details of Persona 3 Reload that just got released today. There was also a new trailer that released and we're going to be having that playing in the background. But without further ado, let's just dive right into the details. So first things first, I think this is obviously like the biggest piece of news. We officially got a new release date for Persona 3 Reload. The game is officially releasing on February 2nd, 2024 worldwide on PS4, PS5, Steam, Windows PC, Xbox One, and Xbox Series S next. The game is going to retail at $69.99, so it is a full price game, but of course it's also on Xbox Game Pass, so if you don't want to pay full price, hey, Game Pass is your option there. In the trailer we also got to hear the new battle scene for the game called It's Going Down Now. Of course with other Persona 3 vocal themes it has to feature Lotus Juice in it. Lotus Juice is rapping in the song. And we also have new vocals from our new vocalist for this game, Azumi Takahashi. We also got a whole bunch of new artwork that just got released today, including the box art, which pays homage to the original Persona 3 release in Japan. I'll have the comparison images up on the screen here so you can take a look at it, but yeah, I think it's pretty cool that they're paying homage to the original design. In the trailer, we also see that Seize now has a new battle uniform for Tartarus, which looks awesome in my opinion. I'll post some screenshots of it up on the screen now. We have one for the protagonist, of course, and we also have like a little wide shot of the entire crew with their new gear. Of course, it's not an Atlas game without some day one DLC, baby. So the first DLC we have is a uh, pre-ordered DLC, so you only get this if you pre-order the game. Uh, the first up is Persona 4 pre-order DLC. It's basically all background music from Persona 4 Golden to replace the music in the game. So we have Reach Out to the Truth, Time to Make History, I'll Face Myself Battle, A New World Fool, The, Re the Fog, and Results. We also got the announcement of a collector's edition in the form of the Igus edition in the West and the limited box edition in Japan. I'm really going to only be going over the Igus edition in the West. And so what that includes is the Persona 3 Reload art book, the Persona 3 Reload limited box original soundtrack, which looks like it has two discs of it, a collector's box, an Igus figure, and a DLC voucher pack. And what does this voucher pack give you, you might ask? Well, it gives you basically a whole bunch of costumes for the game. So for Persona 4, you're going to have the Golden Yasugami High costume set, Persona 4 Golden Persona set for your Personas as well in-game, and the BGM set, as well as Persona 5 Shujin Academy and Phantom Thieves outfit set, as well as Persona sets for the main characters as well so you can use their Personas. But that was just a quick overview of all the new details that came out today about Persona 3 Reload. If you would like to see more in-depth coverage of this recent news, let me know down in the comments, maybe we can go more in depth with it. As for the trailer, when I saw it this morning, let me tell you, I was hyped off the walls. I cannot wait for this game. This game is just looking great. It's looking so good, and I can't wait to play it in February 2nd. But what did you think about this trailer and all the details that came out for Persona 3 Reload? Let me know in the comments down below, and uh, stay tuned to X Interact for more Persona 3 coverage. Definitely am a Persona fan, and I'm looking forward to this game, like I said, a lot. As well as Persona 5 Tactica, which is coming out later this year. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you all next time.